Within the world of assessing and education, this is often a rapidly changing uh, world and uh, laws, uh, regulations and policies do often change. And of course, we need to be aware of those to ensure that our assessments are safe and supportive uh, for our learners. For this section, we are just going to be looking at different types of legislations, uh, regulations and also codes of practice as well. OK, just for here behind me, we have a variety of uh, different legislations such as the Health and Safety at Work Act. We also have the Equality Act, uh, more recently GDPR as well. What we would like for you to do uh, for this uh, section of Unit 1 is to reflect on a minimum of four different uh, legislations, regulations, uh, policies, procedures or even codes of practice as well. OK, and what we'd like for you to do is we'd like for you to explain why it's legislation or, or regulation. Why is that important within your your current assessing role, even your future assessing role? So why do you need to be aware of these and also why do you need to promote them as well? OK, for example, Health and Safety at Work Act. OK, if you're conducting perhaps uh, an observation um, with a, an apprentice, on a railway track, of course, you need to wear PPE, a high-vis jacket, hard hat, of course, uh, it could be overalls, um, steel boots as well. So lots of uh, PPE there that you are going to be using. And also for the, the apprentice, the learner is going to be wearing the same as well. So you just have to make sure that yourself and also your learner are fully uh, prepared uh, in order to promote that legislation or, or regulation. OK, so in terms of uh, this criteria, do have a look at pages 16 uh, to 18 to see a variety of different legislations and regulations. If uh, none of the, um, uh, the different regulations or legislations uh, come to mind, you can, of course, use uh, your own organisations as well. So do perhaps have a look in uh, your own staff handbook, for example, uh, to pick out sort of any four uh, different regulations or uh, legislations. In terms of detail, we're looking for, uh, I'd say, a paragraph of information um, on each one. Okay, so do reflect on either your current or future assessing role.